If evolution is true, how did it conveniently arrange and evolve so many different organisms and creatures needed to break down all of the waste on planet Earth? We're about to get dirty as we discuss vultures, beetles, and the fungus among us. This is Wonders Without Number. Uh, decomposition and decay, they're vital processes, and they are, they really are. Yeah. Um, they play essential roles in the breakdown of organic matter so that it can be recycled, made available again for nourishment of new organisms. We're talking about everything that dies, even plant life, is going to continue to build up, build up, unless something happens. Everything that exists has something that when it dies and everything dies, okay. that means everything has something there to kind of clean it up after it dies. And he's made all kinds of different uh, creatures and uh, from mammals down to bacteria okay. that do that job. Uh, they're, they're clean up, they're clean up committees, so to speak. Huh. You have wood lice and fungi and slime molds and bacteria and slugs and snails and millipedes and springtails and earthworms. <laughs> they all know what they're supposed to do. Okay. They all love to do it. They just do what God created them to do, and it's such a benefit to us. Mm -hmm. uh, oyster mus mushrooms, mm -hmm. they are, they clean up all kinds of things. So they're good vacuum sweepers for, yes. for our environmental cleanup. When a dung beetle is rolling that, he's actually upside down and rolling it backwards. He's, he's with his hind legs, he's pushing that thing. And uh, how does he know where he's going? There's no way that that complexity could have come about by random mutations and chance. Is that right? That's right. Okay. Because you can't get a piece of information and stick it into a gene. You can't take a gene and pull information out. It's non-material. Uh -huh. There's no way to capture information. Okay. So that means all the information in every genome had to have been supernaturally inserted into those genes. Yes. Supernaturally means God had to do it. That's right. There's no other way to get it there. 